that classy, sassy girl who gets good grades. She's got bronchitis, but mom's down to three packs a day and trying really hard to quit. She's Gabby. Hello, my name is Gabby, and today I made a list of all the games I want to play from old Nintendo systems on my Nintendo Switch. No, number one. Number one. Um, I know. who was that? Nobody of importance. Oh, okay. Super Mario Maker. And this is a really cool idea because see, Super Mario Maker was a very big game. Uh, when I had an uncle, he told me when he was a kid, he used to dream of the days when he would make Mario game levels on scraps of paper he found in his desks. And when I was older, I didn't need pieces of paper because, you see, I wasn't born in the Dark Ages. Number two! I mean, like, I understand that you need to tell people what number it is, but you have to be so loud. Kinda, actually. It's sort of my thing. Um, uh, Pikmin. Pikmin 3. It, on the Wii U, it was the third Pikmin game that they made, and I was a big fan of Pikmin on the Wii when I played it when I was a little kid. I think they made it on another system that was a box, but I never played that one. I imagine it was the same. Pikmin is all about you going in the garden and picking flowers, but your grandmother won't yell at you because you weren't supposed to pick the roses. And the roses hurt because they have thorns, which nobody in school told me about. So, and, and that's why I like Pikmin 3, because it didn't have thorns on, on it. Number 3. What? I, I didn't hear the number. What? Ah, you were just too quiet before. You don't need to yell. No, you know what? You're, you're doing them from now on. I don't care. I'm gone. Okay. Right? That's it. D don't leave, gone. Jack. Oh, come on. We, we need you to Take finish. Take papers. I don't need them anymore. The scripts are stupid. You, you, you do need them, Jack. Don't walk out that door. Don't close that door, Jack. Did, did he actually leave? Yep. Um, Looks like you don't have to do it now, kid. Okay, I guess I'll do the next one. Number three. I was at my cousin's house, and they has something called Kibil, where you can watch things on the television when you don't have the internet. And I saw a show called Sonic Boom, and it was really fun. The show is about a blue cat and his pet yellow fox, and he's got a red dog for a friend, and a girl his hair is made of bubble gum, and they go on adventures together. And I didn't know this, but they released a game about the show on the Wii U, and it was only ever released on that system. I would love to see this come out on the Switch so that I can play Boom at home because I don't have Kibil at home. Number five, I mean four, Sh shoot. My brother had an ant colony in his room and he used to put sugar cubes in it and the ants would fight over it in the battle royale for eating the sugars. And I thought, boy, it would be fun to have a video game like that. So that's where the old video game, the wonderful 101 would be good. Because it's basically every character is so small you can't see them like their ants. And even though you can't play the game because you can't see anything, at least it's like you have an ant colony living in your television. Which, you know, is, is better than having actual ants in your home, I think. Okay, d this one's number five for reals. I love going to theme parks with my family, but whenever I go, I'm not allowed to go on, on the rides because I have a very weak stomach. We, I discovered this when I went on Space Mountain and sat at the front, and I upchucked, and it just flew back and hit everyone, and no one was happy about that, especially the little boy from Peru who, who, who screamed at me in Spanish, so I know that in the future I shouldn't be riding on those rides. <laughs> I don't know what I was talking about. Oh yeah, so because I can't go on the rides, Nintendo Land, which is a game on the Wii U, is all about going to theme parks, and that it made me feel better because I don't get sick, it's at least not that much, when I play Nintendo Land. Number seven. If you know me, you know that I like dogs.
There was this game that they released on the Nintendo DS called Nintendogs where you got to raise dogs and puppies and it made me happy. So in there was a game on the Wii U called Watch Dogs where you didn't get to raise the puppies but you could watch them so that game should be on the Switch so that I can watch dogs on go. Number 6. My brother is always hassling me when we go on car rides to places like Red Lobster because he wants to play the Switch but there's no games on there that he likes so I think that Nintendo should put Halo on the Switch because the Switch doesn't have any first person shooters and my brother's all about them bangs and booms so you should get Halo on there and let Master Chief you, you know like have Mario colors and, and, and be in the Mushroom Kingdom because I think there's a game where he's got a gun now and he kills a bunch of people so maybe Halo and Mario are a good fit too you know and, and maybe they can join up with the rabbits and the blue and the blue cat and they could get together and have big adventures in boomland and stuff and I, I think everyone would like that so this is my top five list of classic games that have to come out on the Nintendo switch so Nintendo if you're watching and I know you are you should be really Releasing all these games immediately so that people can go out and buy the switch in droves and like stop buying other things that people don't want so get Nintendo switch and, and get it now while it's fresh and hot before these games come out and everyone buys them up anyway okay bye everyone